Woo! We're back. Playing some more Red Dead Redemption. Alright, let me get my stallion that we captured in the last game, in the last episode. Let's go head out, see Bonnie. Actually, no, let's see what this thing is first. What is this, Night Watch? Let's just have a look. See what we can find. Follow Charlie. He's a good one to sniff out trouble. Stick next to the dog, mister. All right, mate. <clears throat> Lasso and hog-type criminals will stop them by any means before morning. Extra cash is awarded for keeping them alive. All right then. Hmm. Man, I'm feeling really sleepy. Just had a Domino's pizza. I'm real tired right now. Fucking junk food. <laughs> Oh, right. Go on, Charlie. Find us some action. Man, this dog just wants to go for a piss and shit, man. That's what he's doing. Let's <laughs> go! Uh. Where are you going, Charlie? Ah, oh, mate. Go. go on. Let's call this horse Doofus. Oh. Ooh. Pretty uneventful so far. Very fucking boring. I was hoping for, you know, arsonists, murderers walking around, but, oh, he's found something. Fucking hell. There we go, go around. There he is, twat. <laughs> How does he expect to get away like that? Oh, what is he doing? Yeah, go on, bite him up, man. Fuck, let him go by accident. Oh, he's got his gun out. Go on, get out, tie him up, get my cash, and bounce. Shut up, bitch. Collect my reward, oh yeah. Thank you very much, Colonel. Or Colonel, or Sheriff, should I say. Bollard twins. Rightio, then. Alright. We'll just see if the store is open. Nope. Well, I suppose it is kind of late. We can break one of these windows, but we don't want to start trouble now. We're a good member, good resident of this ranch. Oh. Alright. A tempest looms. We leave the herd out there to be scattered by the storm and ourselves left here to die without a livelihood? Can I help? No, miss. If the men get caught out in that storm, <laughs> Can I help? Herd, we'll all die. Fuck you. Man. Doesn't sound like we're left with much of a choice then. Come on, Amos. 
Round up your men. Let's get the herd. Dang. They will die in the storm. Come on, mate. No, they won't. Chill out here. Yeah, it's just raining, man. Get out there and do the work. Fucking pussy. Alright. Company Bonnie. Yeah. This guy don't look good. I'm starting to think somebody up there is conspiring against me. Are you a religious man? Not in any real sense. Sometimes I tell myself things happen for a reason. Like what brought me here was fate come a calling. But nobody made my path for me. We all need to look for answers somewhere. Some in big old books. Others in big old bottles of whiskey. Believing in some kind of divine purpose ain't gonna give me my wife and kid back. Past is who we are, Miss McFarland. There ain't no changing that. Faith is a luxury I can't afford. We have two herds out grazing in different pastures. We'll need to merge them and bring them all back. I think we can handle that. The cows get real ornery in bad weather. It's more work, but I'll show you how to deal with them. It's gonna be difficult to talk in this weather. Stay close. We don't want to lose each other. Yeah, I don't think anybody is losing anybody. Everything is clearly visible. This storm that you're calling a storm looks to me it's just like rain and a bit of lightning. Relax, man. Let's take them over to the other herd. We'll try to drive them all back to the ranch together. Come. I haven't seen a storm like this for a while. We need to be quick. Come on. Come on, bitch. Going the wrong way, man. Need that juicy milk. Every little drop helps. 11 of 11. Yeah. Where is it going? Clearly everybody else is going that way. So where the fuck are you going? I'm trying to I'm trying to organize your fucking cows, mate. There we go. Let's step right in the cross. Perfect. <laughs> oh, oh shit. Do we? I'm going home, man. Fucking hell. Go on, doofus. Get right in the front. Fucking hell, they ain't stopping. <laughs> Alright, we think we got them. Hold up. Where the fuck is that one going right at the end? Oh, did it fall off? Went off the map. Nope, here it is. Alright, we're all good. <laughs> Get back. I mean, we're still at that part of the game where we're still playing farming simulator. But, you know, the beginning, the beginning is always a little boring. In all the like Rockstar games, because it's just like you know, just you know, establishing the story and stuff. So they give you like boring missions. <clears throat> Return to Bonnie. How about this cow here? It's gonna fall off a cliff. <laughs> Don't think she cares too much. All right, let's do that. Well, move the herd back to the ranch. The ranch. Well, uh, Bonnie, my friend, you forgot one cow here. 
I couldn't give less of a fuck about your cows. <laughs> All right, looks like the mission is pretty much done. Just gonna take him back and <sighs> we can get past this farming simulator. Let's go. <clears throat> oh, mate, this farm is far away, or oh, this ranch, or whatever the fuck. I'm guessing it's a farm. In the UK, we would call it a farm. In America, you'd call it a ranch, or whatever, I don't know the difference. Not really into agriculture. <laughs> Alright, <clears throat> not far to go now. Pretty much there. Fucking hell, shut up. Oh god. This one needs to be killed straight away. Shut up, bitch. Or get my gun out. Fucking shoot you in the head. <laughs> Alright. Um, let's see it. How many times has she said that? Literally. Every time, every mission, you might make a decent rancher one day. You might make a decent rancher one day. You know what? You might be a good yeah. rancher someday. Okay, now. Right. <sighs> it looks like we have no more Bonnie missions remaining. So, yeah. Um, we'll have a little look around here. Um... I think we're gonna have to go down to town. Go to town. Let's head down to Armadillo and see the marshal. To visit the marshal in Armadillo. Armadillo. Continue southwest along this road. Alright then. What is this over here? Right, we've got some flowers. Wild Fever View. You have started the first rank of the Survivalist Challenge. Well, that's good. Check Survivalist in the Challenge section of your journal, accessed via the pause menu for more information. Alright. Journal. Okay. Where is it? Well, we've collected one dollar worth of herbs. I'll come in handy. Buy herself a nice disease ridden hooker. <laughs> or rent, should I say. All right. Ah. <sighs> <clears throat> you can shoot birds in this as well, I think. You got like a hunter, hunters, hunter, survivalist, or hunter challenge or some shit. Let me try it right now. Get my gun out. Fucking hell. 
There we go, look, there's a deer. Bang, bang. There we go. Can be skinned by approaching the corpse and pressing Y. Well, let's skin this bitch. Skinning animals provides all sorts of raw material which can be sold at shops. You may also find individuals willing to purchase these raw materials to, to new, unique uses. Deer meat and deer skin. <sighs> sure skin that very quick. Another flower. Let's pick this up. That's what I wanted. Really? That's what you were looking for, huh? Alright then. John Marston, ex-convict, picking flowers. Right. Very quiet. I mean, in the normal like Grand Theft Auto games, you know, it's all busy with people here. It's just quiet, quiet. Random bloody gunshots everywhere. There we go. Got another one. On. Alright, don't fall off the edge, yeah? What? Didn't even show the animation. But the deer still got his skin. Alright then, whatever. We'll take that, I guess. This has got magical powers to skin animals without actually skinning them. <sighs> this is where we shot that guy. I think it was this. Anyway, I can't remember. Shot him here or... Don't know. Fuck it. Is this a chest? No, it is not. Because there's little chests like in this game. Got little, like, they've got bits of cash and some ammo and stuff like that. Could be this box. No. Certainly looked interesting anyway. Um, Alright then. Let's keep going to Armadillo. I mean, in this episode, I'm not going to really cut this down. But in the next ones, I'll probably cut the journeys. So you won't have to watch me traveling from one section to another. Because, yeah. Unless we're doing fast transportation. I'm going to go long distances I'll just cut it down <clears throat> Chola Springs Armadillo is pretty close <clears throat> people are just shooting randomly what the hell is this guy doing I bet you can't beat Ira Shelton in shooting I'll bet you money Eleven dollars, that's it. Alright then. Three birds. Boom. Headshot. Oh, boom, headshot. Boom, headshot. That was fucking easy. <laughs> Thanks, mate. You chump. Easiest cash I ever earned. To be honest, I don't really know why we're picking these flowers. I think maybe you can sell them. Oh, obviously, I think you can sell them because we saw the value one dollar, but... Oh! Sorry, pal. <laughs> we took his cash and we run him over. There. What the hell? See the guy on the horse. He's threatening. Threatening us. You bitch. Get my gun out and flipping blow you to pieces. Prick. Right, let's go. Political realities in America. I think that's what they said anyway. Read it really late, but fuck it. Excuse me. Hey, hey, you got a visitor. <coughs> <laughs> Shut 
Shut up, you! Now, what you want? My name's John Marston. You wanted to speak to me. I did? Apparently so. Why? I guess because we're both in the business of the law. You that fella from the train company? No, I'm from Fort Mercer. Fort Mercer? You that one of them Williamson boys. Calm down. Go on, shoot him, mister. Shoot him. <laughs> Come on, what? You, you getting keep with me, boy? What's going on here? I got me one of them Williamson boys. I got me one of them idiots who give marshals a bad name. Oh, no. Put your gun down. You must be the man from Blackwater. Yes, sir. Listen, that dog ain't too bright. But he seems loyal. Jonah, get out of here for a minute. Yes, sir, Mr. <coughs> Johnson, sir. And you. Oh, I done seen enough of your hide around here, friend. <laughs> now get the fuck out of here. Down the way you can go and frighten. Oh, hard fucking <laughs> hard. Fucking idiot. <laughs> what are you doing here, Mr. Marston? Apart from frightening my deputies. I'm here to capture or kill Bill Williamson. <laughs> okay. Can you help me? He's outside my jurisdiction. He's in the next county. Of course, Bill Williamson and his boys have tended to keep themselves away from my town. So you're happy to have him out there? Oh, I ain't happy, but I also ain't suicidal. My job is to keep this town safe, not clean up all of these three counties. It's hard enough around here. You know, I hear you speak, and suddenly I'm reminded of how some of the people I respected most in my life had a problem with authority. What's wrong with you? Well, I'm sure you and your fine friends have enjoyed spending your time running around pursuing noble causes. My cause is to keep this town from turning into a living hell for the folks who live here. Whole world has problems, mister. And I'm here doing what I can. Why? What's happening? Right now? I got the railway, the people who pay my salary, trying to get me to turn a blind eye to them burning down settlements up there. I got a bunch of cattle rustlers out near Box Canyon needs shutting down. Not forgetting the gang that keeps murdering homesteaders out in the back country. And I got a bunch of hoods over in the saloon, drunk, threatening to shoot up the whole town. That's all I got today. But it's early yet. Give me a couple more days. There'll be more. All right. Tell you what. <sighs> Let's go deal with them hoods in the saloon. Then we'll discuss Williamson. Okay, boy. You're a persistent little cuss, ain't you? Only when things matter. Ah, all right. Come on, then, Marston. Follow me. All right, you fool. Right behind you. So who are we looking for? Bunch of two bit hoodlums led by this fella called Walt. Goddamn road agents who prey on the stages coming in and out of town. Drivers and armadillos spend more time with their hands in the air than on the range these days. And you're happy to let them drink in your saloon? Happy? No. The way I figure it, better they're carousing in there than out robbing decent folk. That's an interesting approach to law enforcement. Rad bastard now. Let's follow him. See what kind of hole he crawls into. Yeah, he didn't see us right there. Mount out, Marston. Walton's our man. Damn, he's seen it. Come on, don't lose He's seen us. You fucking idiot. You're just whistling to your horse. Of course he would have seen you. Stupid twat. No wonder you got so many crimes in the town, because you're a bloody idiot. <laughs> <Go. sighs> 
There's a cactus there, watch out for that John, yeah? Covert operation, this stealth mission that we're on. Spotted us back there, spotted us now. <laughs> I got you covered. Move up to that wagon. <sighs> Behind the great marker, smoke him up. Call some friends. Make this a fair fight. Now move up to that crate. I'll cover you. Oh, I'm aiming for that headshot, just can't get it. Pretty sure I missed it the second time around, for some reason it hit. Let me loot these bitches first. Need the cash. <laughs> ah, no, oh, that was a headshot. Well, there is more of them. I just saw one behind the house, mate. What was that? He, he just ran out. How are you expecting to survive that? <laughs> oh, shit. No! Oh. Oh yes, got him. Trial on the rope. Might as well just shut him up then. Not a bad shot, Mr. Marston. Why don't you check in with me next time you're in town? I don't want to be no policeman, Marshal. <laughs> Nor did I, my friend. I can promise you that. I'll see you soon, Mr. Marston. Yeah. Well, guys, I think we'll end it here. Um, it's been quite a ride. <laughs> If you enjoyed the video please leave a like and subscribe and uh yeah more red dead redemption coming soon see you later